Greetings fellow Watch Comrades and welcome to the 16th installment of the Watch Comrade Show brought to you by RussiaToAll.com. I'm Craig Hester, the Watch Comrade, and as always, thank you for joining us. I want to start out this week by saying a quick happy holidays to all of our viewers and great customers from everybody here at the Watch Comrade Show and RussiaToAll.com. We're looking forward to a great holiday season and we hope you are as well. Well, today's show is dedicated to one watch and one watch only, but believe me, it is enough of a watch for one show. We finally got the chance to film the Baran Stingray. Now, some of you may not be familiar with this, particularly the watch comrades who are really into the ones that are built only in Russia or with Russian movements. Baran, which is a company owned by Volmax, about three or four years ago moved to Switzerland. Uh, Volmax, being one of the leading Russian watch manufacturers, wanted to have a presence in Switzerland um, for a number of reasons, not the least of which is that, uh, you know, Switzerland, oh, let's face it, folks, still runs the watch world, and having a presence there is good for any company that's in the watch business. It helps in getting movements, it helps in your placement at Basel, and so forth. Um, but they felt like if they were going to take any of their brands and move it to Switzerland, Baran made sense because it had been the brand that they had been making more of the dress watches and more of the watches that would be in line with Swiss manufacture. Well, as a part of that, they designed what is, I would say arguably, the ultimate, ultimate combination of Russian styling with the Swiss craftsmanship and Swiss movement and that is the Baran Stingray. This is the uber uber Russian diver. This watch I, I, is just amazing. It's, there's no other way to put it. It is a huge, beautifully crafted Russian diver. Um, not the classic, classic diver. Um, there are definitely some changes that make this more of an updated look and feel, but it has everything you could be looking for in a Russian diver and you get the added um, value, if you will, of the fact that this is one that is truly you can refer to as a Swiss watch because it is built in Switzerland. If you see the Baran SA, that means that that's the Swiss company as opposed to Baran VM, which is when um, Volmax still built them in Russia. Now, of course, the Aviator and Stramansky lines are still built in Russia. Now, I want to be absolutely clear here so nobody misunderstands me. You know I love the Russian watches, I love the Russian movements, but that doesn't mean that from time to time when you've got the one brand that's in Switzerland or there are some watches that they use the Swift's movements, that there isn't an opportunity to create this kind of combination of Swiss watchmaking with the Russian styling. Let's quickly go over the features of this watch. First of all, it's a titanium case with the uh, grid protection. Now, it's not the four-way grid, it is a up, up and down, just the, the um, <clears throat> vertical grids, doesn't have the horizontal. They are removable, which I'm going to show you in um, the close-ups, but it is recommended that you don't do that yourself. That is not a do-it-at-home uh, kind of deal. The removable uh, <coughs> top here is recommended to be done by a watchmaker only. It does have the screw-in canteen crown. This is a 52 millimeter case on this puppy. 52 millimeters. This is a big big watch. It is 21 millimeters thick with the crystal protector uh, cover, you know, the crystal uh, cover on it, uh, the safety frame, and it is 18 millimeters thick without it. It has the Stingray on the side uh, in, a, in, a, in a special plate that's put on it. The back of this is just this beautiful sculpted, oh, it's just gorgeous, a sculpted uh, case back uh, with a slight bar relief to it. It is just beautiful with the image of the Stingray on it. Now, one important thing about this, this has the 7750 movement in it. Now, I know some of you guys are going, wait a minute, this isn't a chronograph. Isn't the 7750, the Swiss set of 7750, a chronograph? Yes, normally it is. This is a specially modified 7750 for this watch. They wanted to use the top of the line Swiss movement, but they didn't want the complications of hurting water resistancy that come with, that can come with building a case around a chronograph movement. So they stripped it down and it has only a subdial. Much like the 3105 in the Russian world is a stripped down version of the 3133. Now, 
This is 30 ATM water resistant. You can truly dive with this watch. It does have the unidirectional rotating bezel, which just has a beautiful action to it. Beautiful action. It's got great super luminova on this one. Um, it, the shape, okay, it's an integrated silicone strap on here, okay? The shape of this watch, for its size, it fits and wears beautifully on the wrist, beautifully. Let's see, what else do we have here on this one? Sapphire glass, sapphire crystal glass. The Russians tend to refer to it as glass. Sapphire crystal, that's no surprise there. Um, it is an automatic movement in here. That's another reason for uh, you know this being a Swiss movement in this particular watch is that the Russians wanted this, uh, Volmax wanted this to be an automatic diver. Again, it does have the screw-in crown. I like your classic uh, diver with the uh, canteen style. Genuine silicone strap that comes with two straps and this beautiful, beautiful display case with the stingray, with a genuine stingray on it. Uh, it comes with all of the additional tools. It comes with two straps. Um, it does have the screw-in back cover. It has a 30 ATM. This, the Buran Stingray, to me, this is the uber, uber diver right here. You, you will just, this is one you will hand down your, to your son or daughter, what have you, who will hand it down, who will hand it down, who will hand it down. This is a family heirloom the minute you pick it up. Now, one important thing about this, it does have the free shipping, so you use the last four digits of the, um, of the SKU number for your coupon with the uh, letters FS. But one important thing about this, we do not keep the Buran Stingrays in stock. We order them from Switzerland just as soon as you order, and it's about seven to 14 days uh, from the time you order till the time we get it to you. So those are the key elements of the Buran Stingray by now the Buran Company of Switzerland, which is still owned by Volmax of Russia. So you get this kind of really cool, amazing Russian styling and design with the Swiss 7750 movement in it. So be sure and check it out. This will be the only segment about this. There won't be a separate one because we are focusing only on this watch for this edition of the Watch Comrade Show. A couple of other key specs on this watch. First of all, it is a 24 millimeter strap and it is an integrated custom built silicone strap for this watch with Stingray on the buckle. It is a limited edition of only 500 pieces and it weighs 197 grams, which actually is lighter than it would be if it weren't the titanium. One of the other things that you really want to know about this one that is so cool, and this is the first watch I've ever actually um, had the pleasure of selling that has something along these lines, a company called Chronifiable Laboratories in Switzerland tests every watch and certifies them, and this does come with a signed certificate of the test results. Some of the things they test, um, they test the, um, they measure the push and pull forces on the stem, they measure the forces on push buttons, they test reaction to magnetic fields, shock resistance test, water resistance test, and if they don't pass, they don't get this certificate from Chronifiable Laboratory. So that's another special one-of-a-kind element in terms of the watches that we deal with here at um, Russia 2 All and the Watch Comrade Show that you get with the Buran Stingray. If you have any questions, be sure and post comments. I'll be happy to answer them. And as always, please rate our videos and subscribe. I'm Craig Hester, the Watch Comrade, and as always, keep watching.